hold on. So first, um, I just wanted to welcome everyone. Thank you so much for taking the time um, out of your night to join us. Um, I'm so excited to share with you um, the one simple change that I've made um, that has really been a blessing in all aspects of my life. Um, I just want everyone to learn something that you might take with you. So I'm gonna share my screen really quick. Um, we do have a little presentation for you here. Is it working, Sharon? Yes. Yeah. It's good, on presentation mode, everything looks good? Okay. So the goal here really is to just inspire healthy living um, and make that simple change. So first, uh, we are gonna start with the negatives. Sorry to put a damper, but um, it is the truth. Um, we really are unhealthy. Um, and you can see it in these statistics here. So heart disease, cancer, diabetes, obesity, these are all things that are in um, our society. Whether you know someone or you don't, um, whether you are someone or you're not, um, this is a thing that's going on um, in our society today. So that really does stem from poor diet. Um, another thing that I wanted to just talk about is this uh, environmental toxins are increasing. So take a look at these examples, pollution, water contaminants, um, you know, plastics, chemicals, all these things that we are dealing with in our everyday lives that our body has to filter out, um, that they're just increasing the toxins. Um, another thing is the food quality. Our food quality is decreasing. So what this shows here is more than 50% of what Americans eat is processed, um, preservatives, flavor enhancers, artificial coloring, um, things that they're doing to our food that's actually um, making it look better, making it last longer so that when you go to buy it, it looks good, but really um, what's in it is not doing our bodies any good. Um, so what can we do with all those things to prevent or um, be healthier and be our better selves? Uh, exercise, that's so important. Um, you have to get your body moving and flowing. Um, think about how you feel after you exercise. I know after I exercise, I want to come home and clean everything. You know, I want to do something. I have so much more energy. Um, sleep. Sleep is so important. You get you need seven to eight hours of sleep. Um, you do a lot with your body every day, um, no matter what it is. So it's really important to give your body and your mind that time to rejuvenate and regroup um, and get that rest that you need to have more energy the next day. Uh, managing stress. So what I like to think about with managing stress is stress is a negative thing, you know, negative feelings, um, whether it be work, traffic, something that negatively affects you. Um, I like to think of it as doing something positive to manage that. So um, do something that makes you happy, do something that um, feeds your soul, uh, watch the sunset, watch the sunrise, uh, meditate, you know, all these things that positively affect your body um, helps manage that stress. Um, drinking water. Drinking water is so important. Um, we all know this. Um, your body is made of water. Um, you need to flush out the toxins um, by drinking lots of water. Um, use safer products. So what I was talking about earlier with the, um, the toxins in your, you know, hair care products and things like that, use things that you know um, has good stuff in, in it for your body. Um, and eating real food. Eating real food, this food, this is the most important thing. So um, real food being um, whole food nutrition. Um, your body has a natural way of healing itself and of functioning. So if you give it the proper nutrients, then you will be healthier and flow much better. Um, so let's focus on the fruits and vegetables really quick here. So the most, most diseases are preventable with good nutrition. So we're all told that fruits and vegetables are good for us, but nobody really goes into depth as to why um, and what getting a wide variety of them could really do for your body. Um, so that brings me here. Um, you need seven to 13 servings of fruits and vegetables every single day. That's a lot. So seven being a child, 13 being a male who exercises. So I probably fall somewhere in 10, the 10 range, somewhere there. Um, that's a lot. Think about it is half of your plate. So half of your plate needs to have fruits, vegetables, and a wide variety of colors too. You need the whole rainbow. Each color um, of the fruits and vegetables have different things that they do good for your body. Um, and getting, think about 10 to 13 half plates every single day, that's a lot. Um, so the, why, do we, um, why do we need so many? Um, a really good reason is because the produce is picked before nutrition fully develops. So like I said, it's that, um, 
the way that it comes to the store, like they say broccoli could have 50 to 80% less of its true nutrients um, by the time you purchase it. So it's pretty crazy knowing that. Um, so I really want to say something about myself really quick. So I did sit down and I thought about it and I realized I really was not eating the whole foods um, that I needed or even enough. As you can see, we need so many. Um, so I subconsciously knew that at one point in my life um, and I started to take back control of my health in small ways. So um, like I would buy beet powder to put in my water or maybe like some kind of um, detox vitamin thing, like a week long thing, um, something like that. Um, and right around that time that I was going through all that, so naturally and organically, um, what I'm about to talk to you about um, was placed into my life. I met my friend Doug at the dog park and what he shared with me was um, the start to a beautiful journey that I've started. And it's why I'm here talking to you tonight um, with what I've been learning about the power of fruits and vegetables. I just wanna educate everybody um, on what I know. And I've been learning alongside Sharon, who you just met. Um, and uh, she's actually Doug's wife and I met her and she's actually been teaching me so, so much. And I can't wait for you to hear from her for a little bit, just for these uh, next couple of slides really quick, so. Great, thank you, Gabby. Okay, well, um, I learned about the power of fruits and vegetables 21 years ago. And so I'm gonna share with you some of the concepts of what's happening at the cellular level, and it's called oxidative stress. And so if you look up any disease process, oxidative stress is a culprit okay so like say alzheimer's and oxidative stress or diabetes and oxidative stress we all have a certain amount but um we want to reduce that i'm wondering if this is good okay um we want to reduce that and how you reduce it is through antioxidants and that comes from fruits and vegetables and so you want to have as many antioxidants as possible in your bloodstream and that's um what we need to work on so the apple if you slice the apple all of a sudden the the air is hitting the apple and it starts to age and that's what we're doing all the time we're we're aging and then when you put the lemon on the apple that actually helps it to slow the aging you guys have all probably experienced that somehow right um so anyway that's oxidative stress let's go to the next one i'm trying to fix um my gallery and stuff, my view. Here we go. I like to see everybody. Okay, now I can see everybody. Um, and then the other thing I like to teach about fruits and vegetables, something I didn't know, um, you know, because I always ate vitamins growing up. You know, my grandmother would give me some vitamin C and I thought it tasted good with rose hips. Um, I knew that vitamins made me nauseous and I knew that people did it if they felt like they weren't eating properly, right? Um, but what I've learned is that vitamins and minerals and live enzymes come from fruits and vegetables. So when people talk about taking a vitamin, it's actually better to have the fruit or vegetable. So if you look at the, the first part, Gabby, if, I don't know if you can click on it, um, then the, a vitamin supplement only has about 30 different vitamins or minerals. Okay. And an apple though is 10,000 nutrients. So that on the right is one page of 25 of what's actually in an apple. And it's not just the apple, it's the kale, the beets, the broccoli, the spinach, they all have like 10,000 nutrients. So when you're eating fruits and vegetables, you're getting so much more than a multivitamin. And what they do is they say, oh, there's vitamin C, let's replicate that and put it in the multivitamin. And so they jack it up to like 1500, where in the, the actual apple or the orange, it's like five milligrams, okay? And then like for green leafy vegetables, it's a great source of iron. It's a great source of calcium. If you've ever gone to the doctor and he said, or she said, um, take calcium, they're also going to say take magnesium because that helps it to get absorbed, right? Well, in green leafy vegetables, it doesn't just have the magnesium. It has the phosphorus, the boron, the vitamin K, all those little elements that are in nature that make it absorb and stay in the bones. So that's why... Fruits and vegetables are so important. Time Magazine said, the news isn't that they are good for you, it's that they're so good they could save your life. That's why sometimes you see people juicing. And if you look at the next slide, the American Cancer Society poster is all fruits and vegetables. So to reduce your risk of any disease process, you wanna eat fruits and vegetables. So a vitamin supplement can't compare 
to what Mother Nature has provided in fruits and vegetables, but we do have something that is the next best thing. I was introduced to it and taken on a better path 21 years ago when my friend just was so excited. She grew up in a totally different family than me. I was from a meat and potatoes family from Ohio, so there were no fresh fruits and vegetables on the table at all. Um, but she grew up in a household where they were trying to fight a disease, lupus, with her mom. They were juicing for her. So they were juicing fruits and vegetables to do that. So the concept of juice plus really made sense to them. That's fruits and vegetables that have been pulverized. They take out the sources of the water. They put it in the so on. I was like, sign me up. I was a guidance counselor. I had already had one baby. I was on my second baby. And I was like, okay, this is great. I'm going to get healthier. And I started to really look at the research. I have a research background. And it really was very powerful research. Back then it was only three studies. Now it's 42, showing a juice on work. And it really works on that oxidative stress, especially. Okay, go ahead, and Gabby. Uh, you're making a weird noise. Is that your computer making that noise? Is it mine? I don't know. Yeah. <laughs> I don't know. Yeah, that's good. Better? You know what to do. Awesome. Okay. I don't know. He knows everything. I don't know what that was. <laughs> um, so this is just showing you that one simple change that we were talking about before. Um, it is, it's juice plus. So you'll see here it's fruit, vegetable, and berry blends. Um, this is just going to show you what's in each bottle really quickly, and then I'll get into it. Um, beet, peach, pineapple, lemon peels. Um, actually, in peels of the fruits and vegetables is where all the nutrients actually um, is, and nobody eats the peels. So it's pretty cool that they um, have them in these bottles here. Um, and there's a wide range of colors, like I was mentioning earlier before. Um, so this, what is Juice Plus? So Juice Plus adds a nutrition from those 30 fruits and vegetables to your um, and berries to your diet. So that's every single day that you'll have um, able to get that. Um, the whole foods are harvested at the peak of the ripeness, so the, the nutrition is intact. Um, they pulverize them and they put them in the powders into vegan capsules and they also do them into um, the chewables, which the chewables are awesome if, you know, there's a child um, or if you're an adult and you don't like to take the capsules, um, the chewables do um, the same thing and they taste awesome. I did have them before. <laughs> Um, the omegas here, um, we'll get into in a little bit, but we do have omega blend as well. Um, so juice plus complete shakes. I love the shakes. Um, they're my favorite thing. Um, I always say that um, your gut health is so important. And I feel like starting with liquids in the morning um, does so well for that. Um, your gut health is the foundation for your overall health. Um, so these complete shakes really help with my digestion, digestive system. Um, it's vegan, non-GMO ingredients, gluten and dairy free, uh, lots of plant protein, as you'll see with broccoli sprouts, radish sprouts, all those things, um, eight grams of fiber. So it's a lot of really good fiber, um, stabilizes your blood sugar um, and they taste awesome. I like the one that I like right now is I'm making just chocolate, peanut butter, banana, super simple, but it's so yummy. Almond milk in there. Um, so those are really good. Um, for your gut health. Plant-based omegas. This is something new to me a little bit, um, but I love them so much. I didn't start out with them, um, but what these plant-based omegas are is you don't need to get your omegas from fish is what a lot of people think, um, but um, because the fish get their omegas from plants, from algae. So we just, the company decided why not go straight to the foy, to, straight to the source, um, the plant idea, is really where it came from. Um, and it has all kinds of benefits, heart, brain, joint, skin, eyes, um, all these things. And I, what I'm feeling from them, I've probably been taking the omegas for like two months, maybe two and a half months or so. Um, and I definitely get the brain part because I feel like it might not make sense to any of you, but it makes sense to me. Like my thinking more clearly, um, things are processing better. I don't know if that makes sense, but, um, my skin has been awesome. And normally, I mean, I always had really good skin. I never had bad skin, but I'm starting to notice a little bit of a change, um, especially with my scar. So I have like a scar for my dog and um, a really bad scar on my knee. And it's so weird. I just started realizing that they're kind of going away. You know how like around scars, there's like darkness a little bit. 
well, my darkness is like clearing away and I really didn't have anything else to associate it with rather than me just taking the omegas. Um, even my boyfriend the other day was like, oh, that scar, I have a really bad scar on my knee. Oh, that scar on your knee is looking a little bit better. And I'm like, and he never, I never told him like what I thought was helping it. So I was like, okay, somebody else is noticing that. So um, my skin has been awesome. 100% plant-based, pure and sustainable, um, vegan capsules like the other ones, cold pressed, um, all these really awesome um, seed oil that you'll see on the left here. So I've just come to really enjoy these omegas. I listened to Dr. Nilani, which is, she is a really awesome part of our community. And um, I just started, what she said is, um, yes, it helps when you take them on the inside, but she likes to take them on the outside and boost that. So she puts them on her face. I started doing that. So we'll let you know how that goes. <laughs> but, um, so this next slide here is just showing you how um, these products really just bridge the gap between what you do eat and what you should eat. Uh, I know I love my pizza. I love my fries. I have a French fry problem. Um, but I also love my fruits and vegetables. So the fact that um, this is helping me with that middle ground um, really shows what it can do. Um, and like you saw how many servings you need every single day. So just getting, just with these project products, I'm getting 30 about 30 every day. Um, so I don't feel as bad. Um, so I'll just share a little bit about my story with it. So I started taking Juice Plus and I've probably been taking it for about three to four months now. Um, after just a week of taking it, I immediately started to crave these better foods. Like I wanted to eat more vegetables. I wanted to eat fruits um, as my snack. I had apples and peanut butter um, instead of chips. I had um, like fruit salads for my day on my days. Um, and I just started to notice another thing was the lack of inflammation. Can't really explain it, but I used to have this thing where I hated certain shoes I would wear because my ankles I felt were like big or puffy and ugly. I don't know, ignore me, but um, I had this one thing and I just have noticed that I don't feel that anymore. I don't, I don't see that on my ankles anymore. Um, and I don't really have anything other, I don't really know um, why other than that I've been eating things that help with that, these fruits and vegetables. Um, so little things like that in the beginning is what I was like, okay, so getting more of these into my diet is really doing something magic to me. Let's see what happens if I keep going. Then it turned into, um, you know, me feeling more confident um, in myself because I know my body was feeling so good that I was getting all these nutrients that I wasn't before. And now my body is functioning at its best. Um, some of you know I work at a really big restaurant for now. Um, I do a lot of speed walking all day long. Um, so what I'll do is have a shake in the morning before work with my capsules. And then when I'm at work, I just have so much energy. Those levels have been just completely risen and I can uh, run around that place with no problem for hours. Like sometimes I work 12 hour shifts and I notice that I'm feeling fine, like working harder for longer. So I think that's really pretty cool with um, my experience in these. Um, so this next slide just shows a little bit about um, how awesome this community is. They really believe in inspiring this healthy living. So they had this program called Healthy Starts for Families. And what that does is um, it offers for children ages four to 18, um, also with full-time college students, they receive Juice Plus for free for up to four years um, with the paying adult, which is so, so cool um, that they will do that. Um, just to inspire these children to eat better. Um, so here's a couple of little statistics about um, what the parents reported with their children, missing fewer days of school, um, fewer over-the-counter prescription drugs, drinking more water, um, visiting the doctor less, um, things like uh, less fast food and soft drinks, which the next one is eating more fruits and vegetables. Like I said, my cravings went up for sure with all this good stuff that I wouldn't think I was eating before. Um, so it's really cool that kids also are showing that same thing. Um, so Juice Plus is unique. Why is it unique? Well, here's three things. Um, so it's not a multivitamin, it's food. So, well, Gab, you're taking pills every day. That's vitamin, right? No, it's food label, um, non-GMO ingredients, vegan, kosher, dairy and gluten-free, which is super cool. Um, it's got an actual nutrient label and everything. Um, it's NSF certified. This is super cool because it's third-party validated. So it really shows that what's on the label is in your bottle, in your body, in the bottle and what's in the bottle is on the label, which 
people um, these days really want to know what's in their food and if th what they're putting in their body is true. Um, they also have NSF for sports certified capsules, so they do extra um, testing for you know the professional athletes that need to show um, that they're eating, you're getting the right things, you know. Um, this next thing is that it's the most researched brand name nutritional product in the world. It's pretty cool. They've got over 40 plus peer, um, peer reviewed published clinical studies, um, which these are gold standard research studies at leading hospitals and universities, um, a bunch of them listed here. So the gold standard method is randomized, double blind, placebo controlled, um, tested on the product itself, human clinical trials, which is so cool to say because it actually proves some, that you're, it's doing something to people and it's proving these kinds of results. And that's what um, doctors um, have been backing, why doctors have been backing it so much is because this research does really show results. It shows all these things. So this is a list of um, certain things that the researchers have shown. Um, cardiovascular wellness, healthy inflammatory, inflammatory response, um, quality of life, health cholesterol, um, healthy lung functions, function skin and gums, um, immune system. It really does help keep you know children out of the doctor more, like they're saying less pre um, prescription drugs. Um, maintain healthy DNA, reduces oxidative stress like Sharon was talking about before, um, and then absorbed by the body. That's really cool because your body knows what to do with fruits and vegetables, and it goes down to the cellular level once it's absorbed into the body. So that's really um, good stuff to know. Um, so this next slide here is about um, the tower garden. So I cannot wait to have one of these on my own. So is Doug still on here? I do want to pass it over to somebody who's actually an expert on this. <laughs> if Sharon wants to talk. I don't know if Doug can. If, okay, Sharon. <laughs> so yes, we have a tower garden. We live in Coral Springs. If anybody wants to come and see it, we have four. And we even grow seedlings for our customers and things like that. It's really become just a thing, a fun thing, a recreational thing. During the quarantine and COVID and all that, people have bought things for their house. This was a huge superstar. We actually ran out of them, the supply. Um, it's just the wave of the future to grow your own produce so that you know that you're going to have some produce and not depend on the store but also just for fun, you know, it's fun. It has like a little trinkling fountain, you know, where at the bottom there is a pump and it pumps up water to the top and then it trickles, uh, trickles uh, water on the roots of the seedlings, which you can grow yourself. So it all comes from just seeds. And so it's very much like making your own money because you're making plants from just tiny seeds and you eat off of it and you cut it down and it comes back. And it keeps coming back and it keeps coming back. So it really just pays for itself. Doug, you want to show the picture of your four towers? He just came on. Yeah. Um, so, uh, Keep talking. Something like this at the land exhibit at Epcot. It's a vertical aeroponic and hydroponic system of growing. So aeroponic means that half the time it's on with water, half the time it's just letting the air come onto the roots so that it becomes stronger and it grows faster. It's kind of like aerating the golf course, why they make the holes in the golf course to aerate. So it's really a neat technology and it's a way to just have it on your porch or in your kitchen and it takes up less space less water. I always think of those places that are like running out of water. I mean, it takes very little water, just what's in the bottom and it recycles it. My problem with growing anything always was watering. <laughs> so this waters itself. It's really neat. This is our tower gardens here um, that Doug just put up. Pretty cool. You have the best tower gardens. <laughs> So you could grow all kinds of things. You could grow arugula, lettuces, cilantro, basil, Swiss chard, mint. There's my pride and joy, my lettuces right there. Yeah. The best. <laughs> That's a cool video. I didn't know you had that. I like it. Awesome. We have a lot of fun with the tower gardens. <laughs> oh wait, I can't see. Um... Uh -oh. And just let me mention, we have a Tower Garden event on Facebook going this week. It started on Sunday and it goes through this Saturday. So if anybody wants to hop in there, Gabby can help you get in there. And actually, we'll be showing off our stuff on Saturday. We're kind of closing it out. Awesome. Good stuff. Check out this thing. 
Um, okay, so this isn't a sales call or anything, but this is really cool to just show you that um, they do really make it um, so that anybody can be able to afford it. Um, I like to, so at first when I was doing this, I was like, oh God, $75 a month, another payment. But then when I looked at it like this, $2.50 a day, try to take $2.50 and go to the grocery store and buy 30 variety of fruits and vegetables and berries you know so that's kind of way I thought of it and it was pretty cool and I did tell you um free for kids and stuff like that which is pretty cool um and I know I take comfort in knowing that I can make my shake for two dollars and 33 cents instead of going and buying a smoothie for like six dollars somewhere else um so just showed that briefly um so good nutrition equals results so what you put in is what you get out and knowing that all these things that are good for you, you're doing for yourself, is gonna give you those good results. Um, so with all of my awesome experiences that I did share, um, I've chosen to make it my purpose um, to just share with anyone and everyone who will listen because it truly is powerful what this knowledge could bring you. Um, and that's what really drives me. Um, the fact that there's something out there that I have access to, that I believe in, that could benefit every single one of us in all kinds of ways, That's pretty special to me and we say that it's a gift you know because it really just is something that you're doing for yourself that you're bettering yourself with so and I think that's all I want to share I didn't know what to touch on with the screen so <laughs> well we have some of the um just different cookbooks because you got like thousands of people who are making simple changes, like one step at a time, just simple changes. They're doing juice plus, but they're also doing lots of other things. Those people came up with all these cookbooks. So um, they're like the healthiest cookbooks and we have them free and available for you. We have webinars, we have a Facebook group, supportive Facebook group with simple changes. And we also have a shred event. Um, if you wanna make a lot of changes for like 10 days, that's coming up in May. So we have a lot of different things um, to offer as our community is, and um, it's all to just help everybody get healthier, you know? Mm -hmm. So great job, Gabby. I think you might even have some people who've already been on Juice Plus, they could put in the chat, like how how they've been doing, or maybe if they wanna share, I don't know, but I think you've had great results with your friends and family who've been on it. Oh yes, definitely had some great results from people. And that's what I, I love is that, um, people are saying yes and doing something for themselves, but also it's proving to them to be doing something and then in turn makes me happy because I know people are happy and, and having that for themselves, you know. So I think that concludes everything unless somebody has something to say, no. <laughs> I have a question actually. Yes. Um, so on one of the slides, it said it was soy based and my husband is allergic to soy. So if that is true, then he would be out of the equation, but I have several other people that I'd like to purchase, uh, the, all this stuff for, but if it's with soy, then I can't get it for him. Do you, can you confirm that or I'll just, um, confirm that for you that it's only with the complete shake. The shake. That's what I thought I saw. Okay. So he can't have the shake, but everything, the other everything else is fine. But also some people who are, who have an intolerance or whatever for soy, it might yeah. be really processed soy. This is more like edamame. So um, it's a non-genetically modified soy, which is very rare. It's like what the Okinawans eat, you know, and um, it's water washed. So it's not very processed at all um, so he could possibly um, tolerate it you know maybe you would use it and he could try it or we could give you definitely that yeah that was the only concern that i had and then i also had one other hold on i have really bad handwriting right now <laughs> uh, uh, wait. i know i had one more question i'm sorry it sounds like you have a lot of people um, that you are. Well, I do. I, I have a nine-year-old um, and myself. I need, you know, this. And I have a sister-in-law who's very unhealthy, and I want to try to help help her as much as I can. And, of course, my husband. I want to, you know, live a long, healthy, beautiful life with him. And I, I want to be less swollen. I want to feel better. <laughs> I put all the things that Gabby was saying, I was putting down. So... <laughs> Um, great job, Gabby, by the way. 
And uh, also one other thing, the tower gardens, you know, we have uh, veg gardens and we grow our own lettuce. The only problem is once you get the lettuce back in your house, it takes two years to wash it because of the dirt. Oh, we don't so the tower garden. No dirt. Is, I forgot to mention that. Like when I saw that and it's no dirt. It's not like a, it's huge. Uh, yeah. <laughs> I Sylvia, don't want to buy to... any more stuff, but I think I have to buy these Sylvia, too. you have to come see her in person. I, I'm going to take a snipping too, let me tell you. <laughs> and, and I don't have Facebook, so the shred event in May, I need somebody to email me, nor, like normal like snail mail, because I don't do social media. Okay. And I need to shred. I feel, I'm feeling <laughs> super good right now, even without this stuff. And I can't wait to start with this because I'm looking forward to feeling even better. Awesome. Well, and now I'll shut up. <laughs> no, don't. You? No, we appreciate your excitement. The shred is using two shakes a day, the capsules, and then cutting out things like gluten, dairy. I mean, I don't want to scare you guys, but um, it's it's a program, and people feel really good after it. But really, using the shake and the capsules as a detox. Gabby wanted me to mention about my allergies. I used to have major allergies where I'd get allergy shots. I'd have to stop off the side of the road to sleep because I was so drained from my allergies. I used to have a Kleenex in my hand. Doug would come grab my hand and I'd be, and we'd be like, oh, I guess that's part of us. But um, no more allergies, no more bumps on the backs of my arms, tops of my legs. So, you know, when you get the right nutrition in your body, your body can work, work everything out. You know? I have my question. I'm sorry. You said, uh, Gabby said that, you know, to, to apply it topically. So it's like a vitamin E capsule. You bite it and you just like rub it on your face. You so the omegas, you can take the, it's a vegan capsule, so you can take them. Um, but uh, one of our friends from the community, she shared, she, Dr. Nilani, she shared that you can just open them and put it on your skin. Yeah. It's like I a, do that with vitamin E already. Yeah, so yeah, you can. Do I, will do, I will do. I will do this all day long. <laughs> I just started doing it. My I told you the dark, like my redness in my skin is gone. Yeah, I have a lot of cooking and burning scars. I don't know if still on here. But she can share a little bit about her um, experience with the omegas if she is on here still. Barbara, you're being called out. Barbara, I'm calling you out. <laughs> It's all unmute. unmute unmute barbara unmute oh i can't do it sorry i just messed her up so i was just we were talking about the omegas and i was telling um sylvia how like i put on my face and stuff like that and i was saying that this is my dad's girlfriend sylvia this is barbara um and i introduced the omegas to her and then maybe she can experience i think you're still muted hold on Hi. Okay. okay, hi. I I love uh, all the products. I take the veggies and the fruits, but Gab introduced me to the omegas probably about what three weeks ago, a month ago, Gab. Yeah. And I love I love that because that really is me. Like that's what I need for inflammation. Um, I have a little psoriasis on my ankle. It's gone. And I mean, I've had it for like three or five, three to five years. It's gone. And um, I, I feel a difference. I really do. I mean, I just feel energized and it's a really good thing. Yay. Really happy for it. I'm happy. I'm Me happy you're happy. I'm <laughs> happy. I'm very happy. <laughs> awesome. And Gabby is really pursuing this. So if you guys think of people that you could send her way, or if you want to join her in this, she's learning a lot and we all learn a lot and share with other people. So keep that yeah. in mind too. Okay. Love to talk to you about that. Yes. Awesome. Stop the recording again. Okay.